In this paper, a state-of-the-art survey of a popular multi-criteria decision-making technique called FASI ahp is presented. A simple example of a multi-criteria decision-making problem that everyone faces during his life is about the choice of a car. How to select the best car taking into account qualitative and quantitative dimensions such as the cost, the vendor reputation, the car performance, and so on. Various techniques exist to help decision makers to evaluate, classify, and select the best alternatives. Among those techniques, FASI AHP is one of the most widely used. The histogram here shows the number of papers reviewed and integrated to the survey based on the year of publication. A total of 190 scientific papers were reviewed. Due to the high number of papers published every year on the FASI AHP topic, we applied the following rule. The more recent the year, the higher the number of papers reviewed, so as to make sure that the survey findings are relevant and up to date. A specific methodology to classify them was developed, which is discussed in the next slide. It is important to note that the originality of this survey, unlike previous ones, lies in the fact that all results are available online. The URL of the website is given here in blue. Regarding the way papers were selected, we only considered scientific articles published in international journals. Six main libraries were considered, as listed here, including Science Direct, Springer, and so on. The papers were classified based on the following dimensions, the year of publication, the application area, the corresponding theme, the journal in which the paper was published, as well as the country in which the study was carried out. In terms of findings, the survey shows that fuzzy HP is mainly used for selection and evaluation purposes, as illustrated through this pie chart. Another finding shows that fuzzy HP is essentially used in the manufacturing, industry, and government sectors. A plausible explanation of this is that the fuzzy logic is a theory widely applied within industrial settings. In this city-based representation, we highlight what topic is specifically addressed by each paper. We can observe that most of them apply fuzzy HP to deal with project and supply chain management, green manufacturing, ERP system selection, and so forth. The table here shows that fuzzy HP is very popular in Asia since more than 70% of the reviewed papers were carried out either in Asia or by Asian researchers. Another important finding of our survey is related to the extent analysis developed and proposed by Cheng in 1996. This method has been highly criticized in the literature and to the best of our knowledge, there is no study providing quantifiable information about the proportion of papers that made use or still make use of the extent analysis. We thus investigated how spread this method is in the literature. The results, depicted through this histogram, clearly show that the method is highly considered since more than half of the reviewed papers, 57% to be precise, rely on it. Finally, in our survey, we identified when the paper defines a framework that combines fuzzy HP with other techniques such as Topsys, Promete, Electre, or other business-oriented techniques such as SWOT. It can be observed that a significant amount of papers, 43% in this case, design such combination frameworks, Topsys, QFD, and ANP being the most popular ones. In this slide, we mainly highlight the features of the dashboard that can benefit various end-user categories, including researchers when writing new state-of-the-art chapters or when developing scientific studies that require fuzzy pairwise comparison matrices, reviewers and editors who can benefit from the testbed to evaluate the novelty and relevance of research papers submitted in this field. Thank you very much for your attention.